Drag racing is a fast and dangerous sport for adrenaline junkies and speed addicts. Few people get behind the wheel of one of these cars, and those few showed up at the Eddyville Raceway this weekend for the 2013 World Fuel Altered Nationals. But there was something very different about one of the drivers. She's a woman. I met my husband. Uh, she took me to the first drag race and he won. I was hooked. Four years ago, he decided that he was ready to retire from the driver's seat and just tune the car, so he stepped out and I stepped in. And she's seen success. Mary's ET is 3.84 seconds and 192 miles an hour. A lot of people ask me when I drive, well, what do you think about it? If you're thinking, it's over. That means it takes Mary less time to get from one end of the track to the other than it does for you to finish exhaling. Mary and her crew races in a series that is no longer sanctioned by the NHRA. It was outlawed by the NHRA just because the cars got so fast and powerful. They got real dangerous and people got afraid of them, but the crowds love them because they never went straight. Mary's safety is not only put in her hands, but those of her crew members. Complete trust is needed from every member on the team. You have to pay attention to everything, details, what matters in this. This is a very efficient car, but it can also hurt someone. You know, tiny little details matter. You don't step out of your Volkswagen bug into one of these cars. Mary and her crew will head back to Texas once this weekend is over, but not before leaving their mark on the track. In Eddyville, I'm Camity Ray, KTVO Sports.